guys so today I'm gonna do more of a vlog type video um, format for the horse box unboxing just because I'm super tired I had to get up really early for an interview today and it's like a quarter to one in the morning at the moment so I'm so tired um, so I, I don't feel like putting my camera up on it stand and putting the lights on and everything like that um, so we're just gonna do it this way um, I'm also gonna have a really hard time keeping eye contact with the camera like I normally do just because I am so tired and my anxiety is really bugging me today um, that happens a lot when I do interviews just because I do get kind of anxious um, so forgive me on that um, but I didn't really use a whole lot of last month's box we had the um, the air paste, the cough paste, whatever it was called. I don't need to use that. I said when I was making that video that I wouldn't really use it. I didn't use the Farnam. I think it's Pure Shield wound kit either. Uh, Bugsy doesn't really ever nick herself, so I don't really ever need to use any kind of wound care products on her. Um, then there was the vet wrap. The vet wrap is still in my um, my saddle bags, so that's about where it's gonna exist for quite a while. And then there was the Charlay's cookies. Um, they were a lot harder than I remembered them being last time. Bugsy had a really hard time chewing them, which could also be because her teeth need to be floated. Um, which I need to do as soon as I get a steady job. Um, also, side note, I'm not going to be editing this video at all, so I'm just going to record it and then put it up real quick on YouTube. Again, I'm super tired. I don't feel like editing tonight or uh, tomorrow because i got a lot of work to do this week with the holidays and everything. It's super hectic. So forgive the, the poor quality of this video. Um, but this is actually going to be the last horse box for a while. Um, I have been out of work for about six months. So it's just, it's catching up to me. I can't really keep doing the horse box um, subscription. I need it for, like, need that money for hay and to feed my dogs and my other animals and things like that. So it's getting put on hold until I can get a job, but my interview this morning was for a job um, close to my house, which hopefully it goes well. I won't hear anything back until after the holidays, so we might get January's horse box um, if I get hired. If not, then it'll be postponed until I find a new job. But anyhow, so I took off my subscription. I emailed them and said that I couldn't um, keep doing the box, but I'd come back to it once I got a job. And uh, they gave me a refund, and then they still sent me a box. And I'm not sure if it was supposed to be what, or if, if it was the box that I was supposed to get for December. I don't think so, because it doesn't have any brochures in it. It doesn't have the little a horse box card. Um, so I don't think it is. I don't know if they meant to send this to me, but um, if they did and they sent it to me even though I canceled my subscription, that's super sweet of them. Um, and this is just a super sweet box. So the first thing that was in the box was there's two bags of these cookies. And within these bags, these are uh, Winnie's cookies. And this is the horse box special and it gives you um, a little bit of information if you guys want you can use that um, that code up there for free shipping but yeah um, which eight dozen cookies which is almost a hundred cookies it's like I think 96 um, if I recall from when I did math I can't do math right now I'm so tired um, for $39 or $38. That's not bad. So what comes in the bags is there were two bags so I opened up one so that I could show you. So you get, if I can hold this properly, you get nine cookies in this bag which are just the regular ones and then you get two 
of these little ones um, in their own little bag. And these are peppermint and rose hips, hip cookies. And they're pretty soft. They're kind of spongy, which will be really nice because, again, Bugsy's having a little bit hard time chewing um, super hard treats right now. So that'll be nice for her. Um, and since there's two bags, that's like 22 cookies in total, which the horses will enjoy that. Uh, another thing that came in the box was another thing of dust on. I have not used the other one, um, but I might keep this at home for like the dogs and cats and things because I have to cut Kira's. She's got dew claws on her back legs, which is weird, and she broke one of the nails. So I'm afraid that once I cut the nail off where it broke, that she'll start bleeding because it broke right over the quick. But you have to take it off or else it's just going to hurt her even more. Um, so I might have to use this on her. Um, and once you take those off, it doesn't... Once they've gotten over the shock, it won't hurt as much. So that'll be just a temporary pain that she'll have to deal with. And then the last thing that came in the box was this little cute, adorable a horse box um, chapstick. And it is 15... Uh, SPF, which is pretty good. Uh, I couldn't quite figure out what flavor it was because it's, if I take the cap off, it's green. There we go. It's green. Um, but it doesn't, I couldn't figure out what it smelled like until I looked down at the very bottom. It says that it's, ooh, uh, it's not going to focus, is it? Focus. No focus, I guess not, but it says it's apple flavored, um, which doesn't quite smell apple flavored. Um, it smells more like cherry to me, but whatever. Um, I don't use a whole lot of chapstick ever, so this will last me for quite a while, and I'm probably going to just stick it in my purse. But yeah, so that was everything that came in this box, just the two bags of cookies, the dust on, and the chapstick. And like I said, this might be back in January, it might be back in a couple of months, we'll find out. Uh, but anyhow, guys, I hope you have a lovely holidays, whether you celebrate Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever you celebrate. And uh, we're going to end it there. Again, sorry for the really bad quality video. I'm just really tired and I'm just, I want to go to sleep now. So I'm going to do that.